Uh, hey there folks, it's the E-Man here, and I guess today I wanted to play some uh, Mega Man X on my, uh, what is it, the Super NES 9, 9X uh, emulator. My other emulator is tied up with my lunchbox. I apologize for the noise to get the AC going, it's kind of hot around here. Even for Maine, it's kind of a little hot around here. Well, it's hot everywhere, but whatever. <laughs> Summertime. I haven't really had much of a summer because it's been mostly raining most of the time. But anyway, let's get to going on this. I know a lot of you guys that, that probably played this game so many darn times. I know there are a lot of wrong packs where you can play to zero the whole game, but I'm just going to play the original game. I'm not going to try to get the super duper thing that you can get in this game. I'm just going to play the game. Uh, I guess just play a little bit. I, you know, there's, there's a whole bunch of storyline stuff I could talk about, but I know that a lot of you probably already know about it, so I don't want to really ruin that. But yeah, essentially X is a new robot that, separate from the original Mega Man. And Capcom has never wanted, it seems, to want to try to connect the original series and the X series for whatever reason. Uh, if a lot of you have played X4 as Zero, you probably get what I kind of mean, but anyway. Let's just get to playing the game here. Alright.
<coughs> you worthless piece of scrap metal, did you think you could defeat me? Zero! Yay! Guess I'm not powerful enough to defeat him. X, you shouldn't expect to defeat him. He is designed to be a war machine. Remember, you have not reached full power yet. If you use all the abilities you were designed with, you should become stronger. You may even become as powerful as I am. I'll scout ahead and collect as much information on Sigma's fortress as I can. I'll meet up with you when you get there. See you later. X, I know you can do it! Billy Zero gives X that kind of pep talk to get him to pretty much get through this game. Alright, here we go. We got our rogues gallery here. We got Monch Octopus, Chill Penguin, the Flame Mammoth, the Boomer Kalanger, the, the Chameleon Dude, the Spark Mandra, the Storm Eagle, Armored Armadillo. You can go to uh, Spec here. Uh, yeah, you can do their names, heights, and tags. Uh, you can just do a map view. First stage, of course, I do is um, chill penguin. Let's go. So you've come! X, I gave you the ability to choose your own path in life. And I hoped the world would allow you to choose a peaceful one. But now it seems that you are destined to fight. Because I thought the world might need a new champion. I have hidden capsules like this one. If you find and use them, you will be able to increase your powers beyond anything the world has ever known. Step into this capsule and receive an acceleration system to boost your speed. Good luck, X.
I was having kind of a trouble there. I guess I'm kind of rusty at this game a little bit. <laughs> Plus I had to get used to the controls a little bit. There we go. You got shotgun eyes! Shotgun eyes! Shotgun eyes! Some cool password music.
This capsule contains an enhancement for your helmet, which will allow you to break some ceilings with a headbutt. <laughs> headbutt. He said butt. <laughs> Alright, here we go.
Yep, we got Storm Tornado! Password time! Yeah, <laughs> the good old days where you had to use passwords. I actually think passwords are cool because they don't need to save the future. That's it. Okay, the first here you have uh, Mega Man X. Let's see, what do we got? We got an E tank, I got the boot parts, the helmet part, and then. Uh, and what is it, two. No, I only got one one part extension. Because, like, if you're unaware, a lot of these Mega Man X games, you gotta find all your hearts, you know, start out the game with full health like you do in the original series. But it's really a great game. I mean, this game's almost close to 30 years old. And it still looks great. Uh, just a sec, yeah? And I do have the actual cartridge right here, too. So The actual cartridge right here. I managed to get it for a decent price. Uh, this this one usually I've seen this going for like 50 bucks on eBay or whatever. I think I got this for like 20 or something. One of the pickups I did a while back. Uh, the label's a little beat up, but it still works. I had to clean the hell out of it, but it works. Yeah, we have the original version. Yeah. As I said before, I had the PC version. I I don't think I've yeah I haven't had it for a while, but anyway. <coughs> Okay, well, I'll see you guys. I'll see you guys in the next video. I'm um, ready to do multiple parts. Probably like do two bosses or something. Um, as you can tell, I'm pretty versed in where everything is in this game, so I I, I can do this game a lot quicker. I'm not trying to do a speed run or anything. Maybe one day I'll try one because I do know where everything is. Well, yeah. Well, if you guys can drop down the password, you can start from where I left off if you want to, if you have the game. Uh, the passwords also work on the um, multiple collections of this game. So, I mean, you can play this game multitude of ways with the Mega Man X Legacy Collection. Yeah, you can experience this game multiple times. Pretty convenient game to get to. Uh, one of Capcom's uh, greatest, I think. Yeah, as you see the graphics are well, this emulator makes them look pretty good, but I mean this game is, is very timeless. I can tell you that. Anyway, okay. Well I <laughs> well I'll see you guys in the next video then. As I said earlier, I'm gonna do I take multiple parts, just kinda of take my time. There's no reason to kill myself trying to do this. It is pretty hot up here, even with the AC and the fan going, so yep, I'll see you guys uh, later. See you guys later. Bye.